everybody, this is Praxis. You know how sometimes in the series there's a video where I actually have a useful tip for you guys as opposed to just giving you an update? This is one of those videos I'm going to share a tip with you at the end. But first I just wanted to ask, do you think I have enough ladders here? <laughs> Most of these I got for free. This one is the only one that I bought. All the rest of these were just junk ladders that I picked up over time. And they are pretty pretty uh, junky condition, but it's nice to have a bunch of them so I don't have to keep moving the same ladder all over the place. I can kind of work over here, run up that one, work over there, run up that one. It's nice to have a lot of ladders. I don't know if you can hear in the background also over in this direction, hear the hammering? My dad is here uh, in the forest, but he's still over at the sugar shack. He's trying to finish that up. I think he's going to be done today and maybe he'll be by tomorrow. Uh, and uh, you know, maybe we can uh, start working together again. I have been missing working with him. Not only is it more enjoyable because you have like, you know, someone to work with, uh, but also it is faster. It's a lot faster having two people. Uh, so uh, anyway, what I'm doing today, uh, you know, yesterday I finished up the Western Greenhouse's Southern Face. Now I'm working on the Eastern Greenhouse's Southern Face. Uh, and uh, specifically right now, I'm doing these boards that go on the tops and the bottom of the windows. So that way when I install a window, uh, it has that little flange with the nailing uh, points all around it and there'll be little pads in here and I'll be able to nail all around it. So I'm working on putting in the top one. Now I did the top and the bottom at the same time. I cut the two boards and then I, I drilled through both of them and I presume I had the other one on top when I did it because this drill hole is in a really terrible place. This uh, uh, is right in the middle of a crack. There had been a nail here at one point and it cracked the wood and there's still, it, there's an obvious weak point there and you can see it kind of you know, it's even flexing when I flex the, the board. So if I were to put another nail in there, like I did here, and try to nail it up there, this would almost certainly uh, crack. Uh, so this is a good opportunity, actually, to illustrate good places and bad places in a board to put a hole that you plan to put a nail through. Uh, this is a really terrible place in a place that has a pre-existing crack going down it. A really great place is right behind a, uh, a knot in the wood. They act kind of like ripstop fabric and like ripstop nylon. Uh, if I were to put it over here, it might crack out, but if I put it over here, you know, it's obviously not going to crack all the way down the board, or obvious to me, uh, and uh, if it wants to crack up that way, the uh, the knot is going to bind everything together and prevent that. So I'm going to place the uh, the drill hole, like, just kind of right around, right around there. All right. So that is going to be where I'm really going to be putting my nails right there. And that way, if the uh, wood it wants to crack at all, it'll stop it right there. And this is how I am putting these guys up. It's just sort of uh, eyeballing them. Get the nail started. Choose a ladder. This one seems most appropriate. And this is going to go right up in here. Now, actually, just as I'm climbing up the ladder, I notice I am missing a piece of foam in here. I've got to add that. So before I completely tighten down these nails, I'm going to put that in. Otherwise, it'll be a lot harder to get it in later. All right, so it looks about level with the inside uh, framing of the window. I can always tweak this around later. And get it into the foam, into the wood a little, over on the other side. Kind of satisfying nailing through the foam because it's so easy. And now we'll drop this in. All right. And not even a hint of any cracking going on there. Now if I'd done it in here, I'm absolutely certain that would have cracked out. But here, it worked out just fine. And I realized I forgot and I sunk that all the way. So it's going to make it harder to put the foam in there. How dare you guys distract me. <laughs> That's it. Thanks for watching.